hello viewers so today i want to add a value to uh, my array so i have a 400 uh, uh, index array so i want to add a 400 uh, values in it but uh, uh, this is uh, not really a possible to add by one by one here so i have some condition so first uh, 10 mm, I want to add a value 1 and after that I want to add a value 2 for all the records so how to achieve this so uh, we'll declare first the values int val1 ok equal to 1 and integer val2 equal to 2 ok here I going to take the for each for loop ok uh, so I'll uh, declare the initial value I equal to I less than 400 okay so uh, now so I have a, a, a logic that first only the 10 record I need to keep the val1 and after that everything what I am setting that want to keep to the val2 value so how to achieve this so simple I can use the if loop here if I less than 10 select uh, the array terms I I is uh, my index so it will loop uh, by from 0 to 400 it means 399 this is totally a 400 equal to under val 1 store the value 1 if not else teams I equal to val2 so uh, now I want to uh, finally want to have a check so I uh, will uh, go on the okay I will give the breakpoint here so under uh, the breakpoint here so instead of uh, keeping the breakpoint here so let's uh, this always be empty so I will run directly it will be the simple logic it's not much complicated what I did here so now initially my array is empty so now in the for loop I going to add the value for all the records so my application is a building here so once if it is con uh, come to the console read line my all my array got filled with whatever the logic I written here okay now if you check the terms uh, array we have a 400 records inside if we uh, go see first top 10 0 to 9 it's value 1 then other stuffs everything it's stored uh, to up to the 400 that uh, if you see here it you can because it's more stuffs uh, to drag and drop it's very uh, tough so uh, it will be added uh, sure because C sharp is that it's not like um, what we developing uh, it's a bug free uh, almost uh, in a good level so you go and try the same so this is the way to add the value dynamically if you have a tons of value you can write your condition so if such a condition i want to add the value like this or not so you can follow this step a uh, one way uh, to achieve this or you can go ahead and uh, uh, create some list and add the value and you convert back to the array so there is a two way of option we have but i recommended this to use if this kind of logic if it's something is complicated don't try the for for loop so instead of that you can do with something else so hope you understand what i'm trying to tell so go and try uh, the same and uh, have a benefit on this thanks for watching the video guys